Xenophon Anabasis, Episode 2 Ha men un presputeros paron etunchane, curande metapempetai apa tesarques, heis auton satrapen epoese, kai strategon de auton apedexe panton, hasoe eis costolu pedeon athroizontai. In this episode, Xenophon is continuing to talk about the beginning of the Anabasis. Hamen Presputeros, the elder of the two brothers, therefore, un, this is igatur in Latin, Presputeros, masculine, singular, nominative, comparative, adjective, with a teros suffix, the older one, therefore, etunchane paron, happened to be present. Etunchane is the imperfect of the verb tunkano. We know it's the imperfect in two ways. It's built on the first principal part, and it has an augment. And a third way, I suppose, is that it has a secondary ending. This verb, tunkano, very frequently patterns with a supplementary participle, as they are called. And in this instance, it is paron. This is the participle, the present active participle of par emi sum, par emi sum. He happened to be there. He happened to be present. Kuran de, so homen presbuturos, kuran de. A lot of parallelism, but the contrast is kuran is accusative, presbuturos is nominative. So there's variety. But metapempetai, he sent for. We know this verb is middle, even though the ending could be either middle or passive, because it's clearly taking kuran as an object and passive verbs do not take objects. So he sent for, metapempetai, Cyrus, apates arches, from the rule, from the region, over which he had made, apoyese, him, referring to Cyrus, over which he had made him satrep, satrapen. This is masculine, singular, and accusative, the object complement of auton. And... He appointed him, apedexa. This is from the verb apodeknumi. Apodeknumi. It is the aorist of that verb. And notice here the augment. When a verb is compounded, the augment is placed here, effectively on the prefix, the preposition which is prefixed. And appointed him general, strategon, and auton then is the object, strategon is the object predicate. And this noun, strategon, is a combination of the noun stratia, meaning army, hey, stratia, and the verb ago, which means to lead. So the person who leads the army is a strategon. Appointed him general, panton, over all of those persons or over all of those places. I believe this is masculine rather than neuter. And the reason for thinking so is that it is replaced by this relative, hasoi, this quantitative relative, and it is masculine, so the antecedent is ponton. Over all of those people, however many, hasoi, however many, athrodzontai, or athroidzontai, however many were assembled, or were counted, or were numbered, eis kostolu pedeon, on the plain of Castellus. Here Xenophon presents us with a number of different verb tenses and voices. Etunchane, imperfect active, metapempentai, pempetai, present middle, apoyese, aorist active, apedexe, aorist active, and athroidzontai, present and passive.